Hello ladies and gentlemen, my name is Paul and welcome back to what will probably, at least for a while, the last episode of Five Nights at Tubbyland. We're going to jump into the fifth night and maybe do the sixth night if I manage to beat it. Or at least manage to, like, beat both of them. So I was reading a uh, strategy on this, on the wiki for this game, you know, the Five Nights at Tubbyland wiki. Um, so apparently I need to release the fumes every 15 seconds because you know Dipsy becomes faster and so does all the others and I also need to like constantly wind up the music box and keep an eye on the uh, Tinky Winky and we'll probably see Nunu this night because in the last episode we didn't so I'm just gonna stay focused I might not talk that much so bear in mind <coughs> let's see what the story has to offer in final episode. Wow, okay. You need to listen. Things are getting pretty crazy around here, if I do say so myself. This new new has been giving me some real serious creeps, man. Oh wait, I didn't tell you. We found him. Yep. He's right. He must be in better condition than we thought. Oh, oh great. Where is he? Oh. <laughs> Oh dear, oh Lala's gone. Okay, stay focused. I don't think I'm gonna have enough fumes to get through this night, honestly. Okay, oh the sound went for a bit. you haven't moved, which is great. It's 1am already, so... Oh, let's... Don't kill me, Lala. Don't... spook me. I don't think I'm doing it very every 15 seconds. Oh Jesus. Oh no. Ah, Tinky Winky. Music box. See, th see, that's what I mean. That's, yeah, Lala has a glitch. <laughs> oh, I wasn't expecting that at all. Yeah, Lala has this like. Okay, that was new. new. <laughs> okay, that actually kind of spooks me. Lala wasn't even at my left door. She was in the dining room because I was kind of worried. Because you know, like, <laughs> um. Because I kept saying that Lala had this insta-kill glitch and, uh, well, I, I said last episode that I was worried I was going to die to Lala because of this insta-kill glitch and it seems like I have. Oh, I was doing so well too, I wasn't even doing anything wrong, it's just... Ugh. What the hell? <laughs> what the hell, Lala? <laughs> I mean, it was going to happen eventually. Oh god damn it, gotta do it all over again. Okay, every 15 seconds, I'm gonna count. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve,
don't kill me, Lala. Like you just did, like you did just now. You spooked the shit out of me. <laughs> Not be dealing with you. I've, I've lost count. I'm just gonna release the fumes. Don't you? Don't you fucking dare, Lala. I swear to God. <laughs> I have my volume very low, so I don't get startled by the uh, the jump scare sound. But it still kind of spooks me. <gasps> what the hell? Did you... <laughs> what the hell? No, it's not fair. Yeah, the, oh my god. <laughs> oh, Jesus. I also need to keep... Uh, if, if you're wondering why I sound so quiet, it's because, you know, it's just turned uh, Thursday for me where I live. God damn it, Lala. You know, every time... Oh my god. This is gonna drive me nuts. Like, I was doing so well in the last videos. Oh. oh, I'm gonna go crazy in a minute. Okay, if I'm gonna try one more time. Ugh. Do this. Don't need to listen to you. Yeah, Lala's my issue. Every time I try to... Every time she... It's like happened twice now. She's appeared at the repair hall and then my door. But in any other camera, she can just instantly teleport into my office and kill me. So... What do you freaking do? Like, I swear to God she's gonna do it again in, like, a, a second or so. And Tinky Winky, I, I'm glad you haven't moved this time. I'm really glad you haven't moved and... Uh... <laughs> These fumes... I'm, I'm not gonna have enough fumes to get through this. You know what? I'm not even gonna risk it. Yeah, you're in there. I don't care if you're in the dining room. I'm not gonna have enough. There she is. Open that just in case. If she hopefully comes by and not kill me. <sighs> this game is genuinely terrifying. I swear. I, I wish I haven't wasted all of my door power. 
Nope. Oh, Tinky Winky moved. Don't kill me, Lala! I swear to God, if Lala kills me here, I'm gonna be so pissed and I'm already out of fumes. Don't kill me, Lala! Don't kill me! Please, I beg every fibre of your body of your skin Ev oh i'm gonna be so dead of fumes left unless Lala just wants to come instantaneously kill me which is fine by her I mean I, I don't really mind because I, I I'm actually because actually star seems to piss me off so much only six percent you fucking dare I swear to god you fucking bitch See, you haven't moved. Glad you haven't moved. I uh, don't kill me. Don't fucking kill me. I swear to God. Oh, thank goodness. Don't. Oh, it's 5 a.m. Release the fumes. I can do this. I can do this. I can do this. Please. Oh, I can do this. Please, let me... I beg the fibre of your... your being. La la. Don't kill me. I am almost at the end of the night. Now, if you could just hold out a little longer... Okay, that'll be it. That's all the fumes I have, so... It's 5 a.m. anyway, so I doubt Dipsy will be able to come attack me. Don't kill me, Lala, please. Please. <laughs> please. <laughs> please. I will be so mad if she did, because it's, it's 5 a.m., I'm almost at the end of the night, and... Yes! <laughs> oh my god, I did it! Yes! <laughs> Good job, sport. Now get a real job. Ugh. P pay to the me pay to the order of Parker Anderson, two hundred forty-eight dollars. Value Tubbyland Guard, Tubbyland Entertainment. That was so stressful, but I did it. Yeah, there's light six on my foot. Mr. Ribbon. Uh, is it uh, I keep pausing because I keep seeing Nunu in the fucking title screen. Uh, do I want to do Night 6? I mean, Lala's killed me uh, multiple times, so... Ah, what? Ah, why am I kidding? Let's do Night 6. I'll just have to be on my tippy toes this time. Hello ladies and gentlemen, it's me from the future. I just wanted to say this will probably be the last video I make on Five Nights at Tubbyland for a while. If you're wondering why that's the case, I have some recordings of me attempting the sixth night on this game, all of which were unsuccessful. I know, I know, that sounds disappointing to hear, but I really can't seem to make it through. I've managed to make it to 5am about three times, only to have it robbed from me by Lala, who has seemingly 
been my issue through my run of this game. I know I have to do the strategy for Night 6, but I was too busy worrying about Lala or other anime sorry, animatronics such as Tinky Winky and Dipsy, who I've dealt with pretty easily, that I wasn't doing it properly. I was deciding if I wanted to go through it again, but I guess I'm going to have to throw in the towel for now. But that, ladies and gentlemen, are the five nights at Tubbyland, if you get what I mean. So that's something positive. Even if I do beat Night 6, there's no chance in hell that I'll be able to do the 320 mode, since most of my reaction times and reflexes on these, on these games are very off, and I want to move on to other things because stuff like this is very time consuming, and I sometimes don't have a lot of time to do other stuff that I want to do. I've been working on a FNAF fan game myself, that I'm sure some of you have, that watch me have heard of, or probably not, called After Hours at Raichu's. It's a non-profit, mind you, project that I thought of about two years ago, surprise surprise, and have been working on for almost a year. If you're wondering when it will be out, probably sometime at the end of the year. Though since the game is my first attempt at using Click Team or making a FNAF game in general, don't expect it to be like the Citizen Kane of Five Nights at Freddy's fan games, because I, I am willing to make improvements with the game such as graphics, sound design, mechanics, what have you. And I know a lot of developers do that with their games as well. Well, not all of them, but you know. I'm gonna stop talking about my game, but if you want to follow it, the link to its Game Jolt page will be in the description below, so go give it a follow if you haven't already. I may not post about it frequently, but don't panic about it. Anyway, there's still some more Tubby Land games to come, such as the sequels and its unofficial remake, Tubby Land Act 1 Rebuild, which I will check out. The developer of that game is, however, working on a new version called Tubby Land 2003. So once that comes out, I may have to check that out too and see if it's any better than Act 1. Okay, I'm gonna finish up here. I apologise if you are disappointed about, about me not doing or showing Night 6 in this episode, but it's really, really stressful for me. But hopefully someday in the future you can see me go back to it and try to beat it for real. Maybe I might do that when I start live streaming or something, but that's all I'd like to say. If you like this video, hit the like button, comment down below what you thought of the video, and be sure to subscribe for more stuff. Not everything I make is just FNAF games, I do. I also do covers of video game music which you can find on the cards at the end of the video or on my channel, so be sure to give those a listen and tell me what you think of them. As always, thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.